Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Guillermo Auto. I have a uh, shark vacuum that I'm having an issue with when I turn it on. It kind of just makes a sucking noise and doesn't work. My problem was down here, um, but the video I'm going to show, I'm going to show you how I, f I found my problem and a bunch of other things to check in case yours is acting up too. All right, everybody. So, this is Guillermo Auto. Uh, welcome to the video. So, I got a shark vacuum. Uh, basically this video is going to be about like just some common problems that develop when using it and how to empty all the filters and things to check for if you're having issues. So the problem right now I'm looking at is when I turn it on, it makes a sucking noise, alright? So uh, watch your ears, it's going to be loud. Now sucking is coming from right here. So usually... Usually when that sucking noise is like that, that means that it's clogged up. Uh, let's go ahead and bring this outside and I'm going to show you what to check to make sure that's not clogged up. And I'm going to show you some common spots that things get stuck that could prevent the vacuum from having its full, you know, vacuum potential. Okay guys, so first things first, let's come right here and we're just going to empty it. You know, it's the, uh, the regular general way to empty it. You take those clips off, pull this off. And uh, let's go ahead, I got a trash can, I'm going to go ahead and just empty this whole thing out. Right, let's get it all out. And that sucking noise that you heard, that is caused when this little filter in here is clogged. So as you can see, I don't know if you can see it. No, I can't. Okay, so this is, uh, it has like dirt or hair on it or something. When this area, when this little filter airway is clogged, then it makes the sucking noise. So I'm going to go ahead and get all that stuff off that little screen. Alright guys, so I got it pretty clean, you know, all things considered. And then to empty the bottom, undo this bottom one. Let's push this button right here. All that will fall out. Get all that emptied out. Okay, so let's, uh, Make sure you get this screen area cleaned out. Make sure this pathway right here with the hose isn't clogged. We'll go and put this back over here. Okay, so we got that cleaned out. It's all empty here. Now, when we turn this on, uh, noise warning again, it's still gonna suck. So I'm gonna show you. Okay. So this is all cleaned out, but it's still sucking, and when it sucks like that, it's not vacuuming good. So I'm going to show you another spot to clean, and that is our little particle filter right here. This guy comes out. When this guy gets clogged, it also causes that sucking noise. Okay, guys, so I got this out, and this one was below this one, so go ahead and pull these out. We're going to clean them real quick. Let's go ahead and put them. These are heck of dirty. Get, slap that. Ugh. And uh, you could wash this one too. I'll show you the sign on the vacuum that says you could wash it, but just leave it out for like a day in the sun. Go ahead and get this one, kind of get the dust out of this one as well. And this is going to be to um, get you more sucking power with the vacuum. These things get really full. Okay, so I didn't clean these like the greatest. I could eat, like I said, you could wash this and leave it out in the sun. Not this one, but this one. Um, I'm just showing you guys how to get rid of the sucking noise and make your vacuum work better. Um, so I put this together, and also there's a, uh, a filter right here that comes out. You could check this. You could blow some air through this. This is just kind of like, it just goes right here. I haven't seen this cause a problem yet, but that's just something to uh, make sure is, is working. It has airflow through it because, you know, a vacuum, it sucks in and then it pushes the air out. So... We want to make sure all the entryway and exit ways are clear. Um, okay, so so I have these out. So when I turn this on, it still makes a sucking noise. I'll show you. I, went, I had put this one back in. So another warning for your ears. So try this. Take your hose off right here. All right, now turn this on, and let's see if the sucking noise goes away. Okay, so now it's working, and you can see, I guess you can't really see it, but it's working in there. So I think the, um, check your hose for something. Let's check the hose for a restriction. Okay, the hose looks good, and this one looks good too. Um, so that means that the problem is coming from down here. I don't know if you guys can see down there. 
probably not, but there is a clog down there and that is causing the sucking noise and it not vacuuming. So to get that out, let's uh, unplug it for safety. Okay, come down here guys. And uh, we'll take a flathead to get to our spot. Turn these. Just go ahead and get this open. And that's our problem right there. Alright, so that's our problem. Go ahead and clear this out. Just kind of sucked a little too much up at once, I guess. And uh, so I'm going to go ahead and get that cleaned out. Okay, guys, so I got it cleaned out. That was pretty gross. Uh, once you break it up enough, you could just shut this and turn the vacuum on, and it'll just suck the rest in there. But, uh, yeah, so that's just something to check. And then you can put your filters back in, and now your vacuum should be working real good. So I hope this video helped you out. Any additional information in the comments is appreciated. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next video.